Hey everybody, this is from section 3.3, number 7 for stats. Uh, this is about finding the uh, standard deviation and essentially all the one variable statistics with a table like this. And the, we did this one in class the other day, but I thought it'd be good to show how to do this um, in StatCrunch. Uh, we've got intervals here, and we don't know exactly where the data is because we don't have the raw data. But we do know we have one piece of data in this interval, which means we take the middle of each. So we have one 37, since that's the middle, four 42s, nine 47s, nine 52s, get the idea. So what we could do is actually write that down. We could write the number 37 and then 42 four times and then 47 nine times and then do our one variable stats. But there is a quicker way to do this and it is a little tricky in StatCrunch. So I'm going to go ahead and open this data in StatCrunch. And uh, the only bad part is, this is great. It gives us the intervals. It gives us the frequency. The bad th part is it doesn't understand what this dash is. It's using a long dash instead of a short dash. So if I delete that and hit the little short dash, see how it did that and replaced it? And now it'll actually know how to read that as an interval of numbers. So I'd seem to mainly go in here and change all of those little long dashes to short ones. And now StatCrunch understands, oh, that's the interval from 35 to 39, the interval from 40 to 44. So if I go stat, summary stats, and this is in grouped data, grouped or bin data. The bins are in that daily low temp. You see here, this is in the, the counts are in the frequency. And it says midpoints defined by the average of the limits. And the limits are there, 35 to 39. So it's going to use the middle, which is 37, which is exactly what we want. And if we look down here, it's going to give us all this information. And I'm just going to hit compute. So there we go. So there is the mean. The mean for this would be 50.16. The standard deviation is uh, 6.086. And it says round to one decimal. So 6.1. Let's try that. 6. One, and there we go. So, yeah, go ahead and open a stat crunch. The key is to get rid of those long dashes and make them short dashes. And uh, away you go. Hope that helps.